so please welcome uh, nagendran my communication styles nagendran my communication styles how many of you think communication is important please raise your hand who raise the hand pat yourself you are in the right place send it so when did we start our communication when we born crying desperately we express our fear to understand the external world according to the researchers dear toast masters there are four kind of communication styles available initiating direct and then analytic and then supportive until i joined toast masters my major communication style was analytical what is analytical type of communication and you ask me most of time constraint you you will not be beating around the bush directly go to the solution this will be followed by perfectionist or the professionals to get the solutions as an engineer i have to assess i must assess lots of situations and understand the problem and derive at the solutions isn't it so if i boot beat around the bush it is a waste of time so most of the time before i joined those masters i employed analytical type of communication style for an example let's say 2 years back it's why in the clack 2 years back before i joined those masters new member of my team approaches me with a problem with a simple problem this pc to another pc is not pinging let's say as a person technical expert expertise i might be wondering that this is a simple problem why he took this to me i'll be asking so many questions to him have you checked the cable connectivity have you pinged the right ip have you placed the uh, uh, pc to the right location all those questions after the discussion and debate we might arrive the solution but at the end of the day what he might be thinking is that this person is unapproachable and this person works in a silo mode and this person is not friendly and in my view as a senior person i have lots of work to do as of customer problems to take care i might be thinking why people are approach me for these simple issues why can't they debug themselves Years passed up in the Toastmaster journey of two years. My major communication style changed to supportive. Let's assume that the same person comes to me, approaches for the same problem. What would be my reaction at this moment? I'll try to assess my situation. How much loaded I am. Second, how good that person is. expertise in that area based on that if i am loaded i'll explain my situation to him how i'm handling tough task now i can't help break it but i'll suggest him who can help him to get out of this issue second thing if i'm not loaded my workload is less i'll not give the solution rather i'll give clues for him to understand and resolve himself that problem why i am doing why i should give clues to that guy to understand and resolve himself why i should do if you ask me two main reasons one next time if he if he faces the same issue he should not approach me he should not maintain a database this issue contact nagendra rather he should he should be able to resolve himself technically the second thing next time somebody else in my team team of 15 members anybody can face the same issue i can straight away tell that show and so person can help you out i taught him how to resolve in that way i, I save the time not with analytical method now comparing the supportive and analytical method which one is better supportive isn't it if you say that wait 
you are doing an important um, work, suddenly you are getting a call from a customer care. Your primary communication style is supportive, right? You start the call, okay, you understand all the problems, all the, uh, you know, different types of credit cards, what are the different type of uh, plans he can offer. End of the day, ironically, you did not want credit card. You was, your mode of communication is supportive. You are asking him. Finally, finally, you are telling him that I don't want credit card. What will happen? He is going to call again and again and kill you with a repeated call. <coughs> Isn't it? So, you might have, you should have employed analytical method. You should, you should have straight away rejected the call or you might have pick the call and say that I don't want the credit card. So, finally, it's not the uh, communication, it's not one set, uh, one particular style of communication going to take you to become better in communication styles or to become a master in your communication. It's that the vision, it's that our enthusiastic way to learn different kind of communication styles and adopt that and understand the situation accordingly you use particular communication style that's what toastmasters helped me to assess the situation to understand the situation and employ the type of communication style which i should do for particular moment with that note keep it up. so thanks nagendran for enlightening us for the Analyzing of the communication or different communication styles where we should utilize or not utilize. Our next speaker is 